Automation 360's Release 27 enables citizen developers to build automation swiftly and easily with an enhanced bot editor to provide a more intuitive and refined experience. Refreshed and intuitive package icons enable a quick and easy selection of actions and provide a better understanding of the bot flow. With contextual assistance on actions, citizen developers have help at hand for a smoother development experience. In this demo, we will look at how Sue, who is a citizen developer at Acme Corp, goes about building an automation and finds the enhanced bot editor to be more intuitive. She logs into the control room to create a new bot and starts with the bot editor. In the action pane, she notices a new icon for email actions and adds one of them onto the canvas. She finds the icons of many other actions to be enhanced as per the brand identity and universally understood depictions. The actions on the canvas now are much more intuitive for easier understanding of the bot logic, both in the flow view as well as list view. The actions are highlighted prominently when in focus using mouse clicks or keys. On hovering over the actions, Sue finds contextual help with a snippet of information about the actions. And to learn more about the actions, she can click on the documentation icon to learn about the action in detail. On clicking it, she is redirected to the Automation Anywhere's documentation portal with relevant information on the corresponding action. Now Sue can use the document links in the contextual help to learn about actions without having to manually switch out of the bot editor and search for the information in the documentation portal. As you have just seen, Automation 360's Release 27 significantly improves the citizen developer experience with quick and easy selection of actions, better understanding of bot logic through visual cues, and help at hand with contextual assistance on actions. Release 27 also improves the user experience of AI Sense, and Sue can't wait to get started. She remembers how the experience used to be. When she started recording UI objects and waited for the scanning to be finished, she often clicked on the wrong object due to a lagging mouse or other issue. Each of these accidental clicks was captured as a client object, and she had to painstakingly delete all these recorded extra unintentional actions. So when she clicked here, this client object was captured, which is not what she wanted. She also did not like the old process of defining an object if the AI Sense model was not able to detect the object correctly due to any reason whatsoever. In this case, she had to go through the process of selecting the object type from a drop-down menu, drawing the object, and selecting the anchor from a long list of text. It was terribly confusing with no embedded help. She is very excited about the new improvements and wants to run a quick test. She launches the recorder, selects the application she wants to automate, and selects AI Sense. Now, if she accidentally clicks somewhere in the UI, or if she clicks before the highlighter appears, she will receive a notification from the product that no object was captured from the click. She can elect to choose the object again, or define an object for the click. If she was sure about the object, she can choose it again. If Sue is still unable to capture the desired object, she will see the same pop-up notification. She can then choose to define the object. When she clicks Define Object, a new selection appears, which provides step-by-step -step navigation. She notes there are three steps to defining the object. Step one is to define the target object and instructions are provided to drag and select the area to be defined. Upon dragging out the area, step two becomes enabled. Step two is to select a visual anchor. This is not a selection from a dropdown. It is a selection visually. The third step is to select the type of object, which in this case is a text box. This step also contains embedded help against each of the labels displayed in the step. Sue no longer has to guess how to complete the object definition process, and the step-by-step -step navigation improves her productivity. She can now define the object with ease and complete her test. 
She is thrilled with the AI Sense user experience improvements and is now ready to begin building automations with ease.